Welcome to Goosey Goggles VR, my name's Dan. Ever since I was a wee lad, I've loved Star Wars and the world that's been created around those original three movies. I've been playing with Star Wars toys, that's until my mum sold them at a boot sale. Oh, that's a uh, yard sale for those across the pond. And completing Star Wars games for as long as I can remember. Super Star Wars on the Super Nintendo, Shadows of the Empire, Rogue Squadron, Pod Racer, all on the N64. Knights of the Old Republic on that original big black box with the X on it. Playing in the Star Wars universe has always been fun. Has it ever been this fun? Hey look, it's one of those little pork guys. <laughs> so here we are in Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge. Today I'm going to show you part one where we have to go and rescue R2-D2 and C-3PO from the perils of bounty hunters. Good details. Let's do this. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Hmm, red button. Whoa! Uh, Roby, a robot. Is this physically impossible? Does gravity not apply here? Millennium Falcon! Hey look, it's one of those gonk droids. Hello fella. Another shit! Transfer begin. Beautiful. All a day's work in the life of a smuggler. Whoa! Whoa! I bet I can get a good price for you once again. See? Leave my robot alone! Aha! Blast it. Is one piece of cargo really worth it? Get out of it. Quick. Headshots you count. Oh, you're new. Nice. Okay, here we go. <laughs> See you later. Okay, here we are in the cantina, Cecil Slack's cantina. Oh, oh hey. I said out. Oh. <laughs> if you're thirsty, you're in the right place. <sighs> you smell like savage junk pile, kid. You all right? Then you talk about my Did savage junk me? pile. <laughs> Ruby, come in and meet the most skilled droid technician in the outpost. Not for me, of course. Aww, she likes you. See? Oh, uh. neutralizer. <laughs> I didn't want to Oof. say anything. You're going to go out there and find the special packages. That's oh, right, Mubo. Little fella, isn't he? You. Thanks. Up to Jax. Um, no, I didn't think so. Oh, my robot. Jax. No, he didn't make it. So the idea of Tales from the Galaxy's Edge is there's a main storyline, but also this guy, Cecil Slack, will give you side quests, and you have to complete his cocktails to unlock the side quest. In those side quests are various missions, like to play as Jedis and get your Jedi fix. Tales from the Galaxy's Edge is predominantly a shooting action game. If you want to chuck a lightsaber around, you're not going to be able to really find that here, other than those side quests. There she is, the old girl, the Millennium Falcon. So this game's been out on the Quest 2 for a little while now, and it's one of the best action shooting games on the Quest 2. It's coming to the PlayStation VR 2, so I wanted to give you a preview just in case you missed it. The Millennium Falcon down there. Awesome. <laughs> Whoa, out of nowhere. Ugh, Guavian Death Gang. So these were the ingredients that Cecil Slack was asking for that I need to put in his drink to unlock those side quest tales. Mmm, 
Yummy. Sweet shotgun. Pretty good. So to unlock these caches, there's various little mini games that you have to do. Usually fairly simple, and you get rewarded with stuff. I always like to keep a thermal detonator at my side. Around the world you can find these R2-D2s and BB-8s that you collect and you can get credits for. There's a certain amount of them to collect all in various different colours. Looks like we've got company. Look, it's a BB-8 droid. Cool. Hmm, more death gang. Hmm, nice. Got him. Yeah, another R2. I hear people around. There they are. Whoa! Little fella. Oh, Jabber's mate, isn't it? This game has a great sense of atmosphere. I feel like people are going to jump out at any corner. Hmm, I've got to blow this boulder out of the way. Looks like we're going to go underground. Nice. Oh, what are these? And more of them? Ah, oh, look. They drop ingredients for Cecil Slack's drinks. Great. Ah, uh, not more of them. Hmm, looks like we've reached the cave entrance. Out of the fire and into the frying pan by the looks of it. Got him! Hmm, looks like we're going across here. Hey, C-3PO! <laughs> Get off him! Someone! Anyone! Get out of here, you! Something that's going on with your eye, mate. Will you return my photoreceptor to its housing? Sure. Oh, that is <laughs> much better. Looking a bit worse for wear there, mate. I am in desperate need of aid. If you could locate my pillaged extremities and repair me, I'd be very grateful. Alright buddy, I'll be back in a bit with your leg. Oh, if you're not good with vertigo in VR, this will have a bit for you. Whoop! What are these little freaks? Where's his leg? Give it back! Whoa. This is his arm. Ow! Just pop that in there. What a bit fun to touch you now. Zap these up. You'll be good in no time, mate. That will come in handy. Pop your eye in again. There you go. C3PO, you're back. Oh, I am whole again. Now to locate Artu. Oh, this is his container. He's gone! Oh, Mike, he's vanished. 
Thanks for watching Goosey Goggles VR. My name's Dan. That was a look into Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge, available now on Quest. You can also get it on the PSVR 2 at launch. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, that really helps, and check out this video where this happens. Woohoo! That's a whole clip. Beta disc, perfect. Give us something good, here we go. Oxygen canisters, perfect. <laughs>